Hey, all of our fans. So it is a super special day today. We are at the dog park and we are about to meet Oliver's brother. <laughs> are you excited, Oliver? I am so excited and Oliver's brother is also named Oliver. Okay, Kalana, we're gonna go meet your brother. We haven't seen his brother since he was 10 weeks old. Come on, let's go, Oliver. Finally meeting you. Do you like to eat grass? Our Oliver likes to eat grass. Oh, and he's also pooping right now. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I will clean that up. You know, this is what happens when you're filming dogs. All you're kinds really of lucky. things happen. You're really lucky to roll in it. You'll roll in it? Oh no, does your Oliver roll in it? Well, at least they're sort of in the same general vicinity. They're not interacting all that much, but... They're doing the same they're thing. They're doing the same thing. Maybe eagles do. Let's get this... Oh! Oh no! He's rolling in it! <laughs> wow! Don't bend his shoulder, he just got poop on it. <laughs> 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 no, his shoulder, not his head. His head's fine. Hi, Oliver from Milwaukee. Can we call you Milwaukee Oliver? Yeah, do you answer to that? Hi. Oh, you have such a nice collar. Aw, you're Oliver's brother. You're so much cleaner. <laughs> <laughs> so, one thing I noticed almost immediately was Chicago Oliver's a little bit darker in color. Yeah, he's gotten lighter as he's gotten older. Yes. Just noticed, just looking at pictures of him when he was like right. a puppy, he yeah. was, had a lot more black in him and it just seems to have slowly... Yeah. <laughs> Our Oliver has been getting lighter too, a little bit. I mean, he was darker when he was a puppy for sure. The other thing I noticed is that our Oliver is a little bit bigger. He is bigger. I, <laughs> I didn't expect that. I thought they would be the same size. But they both clearly like eating grass. Very much. And they have made a new friend. Who's this? I... Rocky. Aki? Rocky. Rocky? Rocky. Rocky. I'm so sorry. Rocky. You were saying that your Oliver likes to run off. You know. Sometimes. Sometimes. He's gotten. We just noticed just today being at the dog park how much he has slowed down after seeing some of the other dogs that just are. Oh, yeah. He used to be one of those. Ah. He still runs, but not as much. Five and a half years old, yeah. <coughs> oh. <laughs> it kind of looks like our Oliver when he's running. And our Oliver is still here eating grass. He's been eating grass the whole time. Well, Milwaukee Oliver's been running all around. for a good 30 minutes. Okay, okay, what are your first name? Oliver! Hey! Oliver! <laughs> okay. Run so well. Oliver, treat! Treat! Treat, Oliver! Treat! Okay, sit. 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 Both sit. 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 Okay. Here we go. Treats. Yep, okay. Sit again. Sit. 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 Good. Sit. Treats. There we go. That's all. That's all. That's all. Okay. Now. No, no, no. <laughs> Down. Woo! Over here. Over here. All right. Hold it. Woo! <laughs> well, he's not going to stop until all the treats are gone. It seems like our Oliver, Chicago Oliver, might be a little bit more tre Woo! treat motivated than your Oliver. Is, is that possible? Um. No, maybe not. Maybe more vocal. <laughs> maybe not, more vocal. I wouldn't say more vocal, I would say vocal. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, well, 
so you are very impatient and vocal. The other Oliver hasn't barked once in this whole treat giving procedure. Yes, you are so patient and kind. Yes, you are. Our Oliver is extremely demanding. Oh, that was good. That was really nice. I'm sorry to call you demanding. I didn't mean that, Oliver. You're very patient and kind too. Well, I wouldn't say patient, but you are very kind. That was fun. And you barked about 10 times, and Milwaukee Oliver didn't even bark once. You guys have somewhat different personalities, I would say. Oh, it's hello. Hi. And his blaze actually connects to the back, whereas ours stops in the middle and is brown. So the colorings are a little bit different. Yeah, our Oliver has a little brown spot here. Here, the blaze was all the way over the head. Oh, you are so gentle. Yes, you are so gentle. Oh, they're both very thirsty. Oh, the brothers are drinking water together. Oh, okay. Chicago Oliver is thirstier. Yep, you have all your water. Oh, okay, a well, good sneeze. Oh, another sneeze. So I have both of them on leash now, both Olivers, and there's something I really, really notice about their behavior on leash, which is that Milwaukee Oliver is very much a tugger. Like, he's like a sled dog. He's pulling me along. Look at this. And then Chicago Oliver's it's slack. The leash is like slack. He's like, whatever. You know, we'll just sniff things along the way. This guy, he's a tugger. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, keep up, Chicago Oliver. Keep up. To do a really quick little interview to learn more about Milwaukee Oliver and obviously you know about uh, Chicago Oliver from all of our videos but we're just getting to know Milwaukee Oliver so Archie I have a couple questions for you okay if you can like maybe describe a little bit about maybe Milwaukee Oliver's favorite foods and maybe like um, does Milwaukee Oliver like water or baths or not so those are those are my first two questions well, favorite food, um, whatever you're giving him. Um, he eats anything, um, except for pumpkin. <laughs> um, no pumpkin. He loves hot dogs, he loves any people food he can get whatsoever. Oh, that's um, very similar to our Oliver. Water, uh, he's not too into it. Mm, um, no. He gets wet after a bath. He, <laughs> it's like he's angry at his body for having the ad audacity to be wet. So oh. he just does not like that. Well, um, that's very similar to but when he's During the bath, he's okay. Um, like recreational water, um, not really interested. We've taken him to the beach a few times. We have a dog beach we don't live too far from, and you know, hoping he'd swim. He, no interest in it whatsoever. But when we ever pet him with other dogs that are going in and out of the water, he does just fine. It's just he needs to be lured there, and humans right. can lure him into the water. Got it. When he's inside, he is a couch potato. He sleeps oh. 22, 23 hours a day. Yeah, so does this guy. Um, 
I, I get up in the morning, sometimes he'll just stay in bed for a few hours, like, no, it's not time yet, I'm, I'm not doing that. Even though when he gets up, he's just going to go sleep in another location. He's not going to go do anything. This sounds very familiar. Well, they are definitely brothers, and they've been having a fun day together. They've been running like crazy. I would say that Milwaukee Oliver has more often been out front, and Chicago Oliver has been following, but we are reassembling the pack right now, so... If the other siblings of Oliver hear or watch this video, please get in touch with us. Hey, another dog's coming. Ah! Ah! Okay. <laughs> well, let's keep walking. Yeah. So we were just talking right now about the different noises that Milwaukee Oliver makes. So Archie, you want to tell us a little bit about those noises? It's actually one of the things that drew us to watching the videos was the similar noises. Wow. Even the, like the intro scene for your clips where you can tell he's a puppy. You probably hadn't had him very long when you got that on you. Like, oh my goodness, that's so adorable. We must use this video forever. And it's a good thing you did because that's one of the things that drew it. It's just a big stretch, yawn, and oh, it's just... So adorable. Milwaukee Oliver makes he, the exact same noise? He just did it a couple days ago where it's like, oh, oh that's amazing. <laughs> you guys really are brothers, so you make the same noises. That's incredible. Same whining. Same whining. Yeah. You guys should bark. And does your Oliver ever howl? I wouldn't call it howl. If he's chasing, like if he's running after another dog or animal whatever if he's chasing anyone or anything sometimes he's really excited he'll start to i think they call it bay where he's like sounds like he's just yelling right as far as an actual howl he's never done it. yeah neither is ours okay another thing they have in common uh -oh. where are you going that looks like a huge mud pit it's a oh, mud pit oh no, oh, no. <laughs> and chicago oliver's like do i want to do that and he's like yeah i'm gonna do it too <laughs> oh guys okay oh no 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 no, you both definitely having baths when you go home. <laughs> Sit. Oh, oh. oh hey. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my goodness. You are so dirty. Oh, they are so dirty. Oliver, you have never done that. You've never gone through mud like that. You are so dirty. Usually you don't like getting all dirty. Don't drink it. <laughs> oh no, don't drink it. Oh no, please. Oh, we've got water back at the car. We're gonna go back to the car right now, okay? Okay, these two boys have just gotten very muddy. Look how dirty they are. Oh guys, you're so muddy now. You're definitely having a bath when you get home. Yeah, we're not gonna go that way. That's where the mud pit is. We are not going through the mud pit. We're gonna go back the other way. Come on, let's go. We're gonna go back this way. Yes, that's a classic Oliver move. Our Oliver does that all the time. Oh. <laughs> what is there? You both liked it. All right, so we have had a super wonderful walk, an amazing day. It's been so wonderful. We want to thank you so much for introducing us to Oliver's brother. And the one story we haven't told is the story of how you even realized that they were brothers, because you were the one who contacted us on Instagram, right? Yes, so, yeah. it was. Um, how did you realize it? Honestly, um, we were just other uh, another group of Oliver fans. Um, we were drawn to a lot of the similarities, not just the fact that it's a beagle, it's like, it's named Oliver too, and yes. it's so similar, and they looked like they could be related, and it was just, you know, but adorable. Um, it really wasn't until we found out, one, you were in Chicago, and we knew that, you know, the other, the dog that was picked up right before our Oliver, was also living in Chicago. But at the same time, Chicago was like a massive city. We didn't think much of it until one of the birthday videos, and you uh, said it's July 30th, and it's like, well, okay, yeah. what year? How old is the dog? <laughs> and you're like, July 30th, 2016. It's like, ah, okay, that, that, that pretty much... clinches it, that, definitely. It, it clinched it really pretty much, but then I, I want to say either the next video or further in that video, it showed, and here we are picking up Oliver. And you showed your Oliver playing, but of course, playing with 
one of his litter mates, and it just so happened to be our hour. And you know, I pulled up one of the pictures of when we first got ours. Like, look, that's our Oliver <laughs> on TV right now. So wow. it has been so cool meeting him, and we hope to have many more reunions in future. The two brothers have had an awesome day together. They both got extremely muddy, but I think they liked it. They're both gonna get baths when they get home, though. I don't think they're gonna like that so much. Oh, no. <laughs> So stay tuned, we're gonna do a sequel video sometime for the two brothers Oliver. The two brothers Oliver, yeah, it's awesome. So thanks for watching everyone, and bye for now. Okay, now that the treats came out, we're a little more excited about staying close by, is that right? Oh, oh, okay. No, that was too much. Too much. <laughs> He's off again.